with Gerard Lycon from Lycon Automotive. We built a homemade rod heater so we can heat the connector rod up so you can push the wrist pin through it. This way you don't have to send the connector rods out to a uh, speed shop or machine shop that was done. I made this in my backyard, it works great. It might be a little bit hard to hear once you get near it, but we're going to head over there and I'm going to show you what we got. Over here, we got a bunch of fittings that I bought from the uh, hardware store. This is a brake line, 516 brake line. Here we have propane coming in with an on-off switch. Up here we have a little regulator to regulate the air coming in. This way you get nice blue equal hot flame. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to put a, a connector rod on there. Now you want to mark the connector rod. You want to make sure they're all ready. You have no time to waste once you pull off the heater. I marked that connector rod. This is the front of the motor. Also, the pistons come with a, a blue dot on it, or you got to find the front. In this case, this is the front of the motor. Now what I'm going to do, keep this rod up for 45 seconds. It will not go on here. It'll expand this thing, so when I stick it in there, I'll push it through. When it pulls, it'll grab it back. So right now, we're going to stick this out for 45 seconds. I'm going to wait until it gets to the nine. All right. Now we're going to wait until it comes down to the six, which will be 45 seconds. And basically, this is the safe way to put these uh, rods on push the wrist pin through. So if you don't have to press them in a vise or a pre uh, press, sometimes you break the piston. So this way it expands it and just slides right through. So right now I'm going to get myself set up. I got my piston right here. Mark, wrist pin out because I'm right handed. We have 15 more seconds. As you see it, the wrist pin area has equal heat on both sides. So now, we have five more seconds. I'm going to take it off now. Here's the front. There's the front. I'm going to set it in. Bring the wrist pin through. Center the rod. Right there. And I'm going to wait. Wait. Now it's just fit. Now it's not moving at all. I can't move it. So now, once it cools down, when that cools down, Look how free this is. No binding, no nothing. This is super free. Right. And that's what you want. You want no binding on here. And that's because we heat it up and we put it together. Once that cools down, it'll be nice and free. This is a cheap, inexpensive way to make it. Uh, any questions on this, you can give me a call. 267-312-5453. Thank you.